This is where flight ET302 ended up in rolling farmland. Behind that fence over there is the accident site. It crashed just six minutes after taking off from the airport in Addis Ababa. And this is where 157 people lost their lives. A computer. For me, the accident report reaffirms my belief the pilots trained in the United States would have successfully been able to handle this situation. The, the senator seems to be severely misinformed uh, or he doesn't have the facts on his hands when he said that. But uh, uh, let's wait and see the final investigation. But the preliminary report, as you know, has made it abundantly clear that the pilots followed the procedures properly. I think our pilots have done whatever they could and whatever that was recommended by uh, Boeing as well uh, to, to save the aircraft, but they couldn't. As you can see, the engines are covered over against the weather and up at the other end, the cockpit windows are obscured as well and there's that big sign on the door saying, do not open. And it'll stay here in this state until the airline and the regulators decide that it's actually safe to fly again, whenever that is.